Hi, hello, welcome folks. Welcome to Lit Valentine. It's my pleasure to welcome you all once again to my channel. I hope I am giving my best and it will help you a lot while you are learning and while you are improving your vocabulary. So with this, let's move on to the next slide. You cannot change your future, but you can change your habits. And surely, your habits will change your future, says Dr. APJ Abdul Kalam. With this positive note, let us move on to the next slide. Learn some idioms which will help us to improve our vocabulary and make us stand unique among the common speakers. The first word is, that's a piece of cake, meaning consider something to be very easy. If you consider something to be very easy, instead of using the same word like easy, very simple like that, you can use these sorts of words like that's a piece of cake, which means consider something to be very easy. If you want to use the word like easy, very simple or the words which can demonstrate the same meaning like this, you can use the idiom that's a piece of cake. Next word is at the drop of a hat. It means doing something immediately. If I am doing something immediately or you want to say something that you are going to do now, instead of using these words which I had mentioned now, you can use the word at the drop of a hat, an idiom which will help you to stand unique among the common speakers and make others to have some attention towards your speaking. The next word is to be blind as a bat. It means somebody who can't see very well. If someone is blind or someone is unable to see something, you can describe them as to be blind as a bat. This is also a sort of the meaning who are called as blind. Instead of using the word like blind, they are not able to see. These are the familiar words now. So you can use these words like to be blind as a bat. The next one is to be in the same boat. To be in the same boat meaning to be same in the unpleasant situation. We all come across with many unpleasant situation in our life guys. So if you want to demonstrate that or if you want to demonstrate the meaning which implies the unpleasant situation or you are being in the unpleasant situation, you are undergoing the same situation. You can use the word like to be in the same boat. The next word is up a gum tree. It means are you having a problem? If you are asking someone that they are having a problem or you are having a problem or you are having an obstacle, you can use the word up a gum tree. It has the meaning are you having a problem. So instead of using the familiar words like obstacles, problems, or you having a problem, or you want to say the meaning like this, you can use the idiom up a gum tree. So try it, make use of it, and be unique among the common speakers in your daily day life. Short recap. So far in English literature, we have seen many things. So let's Precap, what are all the things we had seen so far? So from the beginning we had seen that modern European literature, Homer and his works, Sappho of Lesbos who had lived during the time of Homer and the Athens, beginning of tragedies in city Dionysia, Aeschylus and his works, Sophocles and his works, all these we have seen in our previous video guys. 
uh, if you are unable to see that now if you are familiar or unfamiliar with this you can watch my previous episodes which will help you a lot and with this let's move on to the other slide today we are going to see an important writer euripides he is also a tragedian Euripides became the most tragic of poets. He was a tragedian of classical Athens. He became the cornerstone of ancient literary education along with Menander, Demosthenes, Homer in the Hellenistic age. Some of the notable works of Euripides are Alcestis, Iphigenia at Aulis, Hecuba, Hippolytus, Helen, Andromache, the Bacchus, Heraclide, Medea, the Trojan Women, Orestes, Electra, Suppliants, Phoenician, Phoenician Women. Heracles these are all the important works of euripides guys but the major important work of euripides is medea so let's see the story of medea if you take euripides he had created a strong women character that character will marry jason but he left her by marrying another woman in the play medea that female character will kill that bride and the bride's father dies due to that and she will kill her own children to take revenge on her husband so this is the short summary of the story medea Though Euripides had written fifteen plays, among the fifteen plays, Medea was the important one. So keep that in mind. And with this, we came to the end of the session, guys. If you have any doubts or if you find any topics to be difficult, both in spoken English and as well as in literature, you can comment in the section. and i will discuss about it in my upcoming videos so don't get worry be happy stay happy take care bye bye